What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, everybody out there in YouTube land, you can see our meter here. That's a brand new meter. Alright, so, I wanted to show you that uh, it's uh, 01357. And I've decided, me and my wife's decided to do this. What does it take to be off grid? This breaker is down. So that means we have eight batteries, which is far from the best thing. Uh, I've got four additional batteries, but currently we've got 89% battery. We're charging at 800 watts. And this inverter is on and running. Our fan has turned off for the day on the timer. And this refrigerator, we're going to go ahead and shut it down for today. here I gotta bring it back around it is currently 4 30 p.m. Midnight, and it's going to turn on for about 15 minutes. And that's our downstairs fridge. I'm going to leave it closed. So what does turning that breaker do for us? Turn it off. It stops us from using a dryer anymore. It stops us from using the stove anymore. It stops us from using the heat pump. Well, the electric heater and outdoor unit anymore. Now, I've got a UV lamp that's inside of the ductwork. Here, I'll show you, I'll turn it on. It Well, it takes about five minutes to turn on and warm up. It's one of the, it's a certain kind of bulb. So, I went ahead and turned everything off at the main breaker that powers those main things. You can see this project is in motion. I filled this thing up with water and I've cut open the ductwork. I'm going to insert that into the ductwork. Put tubes coming out. Uh, I'm just uh, making sure it's all the water is going to dry up because we're I rinsed it, you know, off a whole bunch. I want to make sure that the water remains inside of the coil. But we're going to see what it takes to go off of solar. And this is going to be an ongoing process. And it's right now about, it's about 5.30. I think I said 4.30 earlier, it's 5.30. So, what is it going to take to live with 3750 watts and 10 kilowatt of batteries assuming you've got half the power but the next project is I'm going to be taking this apart I'm going to strip this unit down it's about a three month old unit that was damaged uh, due to a fire the water lines I mean the refrigerant lines had maybe had gotten water in them 
but I'm going to strip it down since I couldn't find a compressor and I'm going to turn these into two big solar panels just like that big solar panel so I'll have two big solar panels just like that one and I'm going to take this one out of this box and make a better box uh, you can see I haven't done maintenance on this winter this summer I had it working last winter I was getting about 185 degrees of water going inside it was awesome but I digress I'm just going over of what we are not using no more air, no more air conditioning no more heat no more nothing so I'm gonna do what I can for as long as I can and I want you guys to leave in the comment section below how long can I go without grid power this is Philip 20 with solar power electricity and electronics and I'm off grid I'll let y'all later hello lazy to get gentlemen thanks for watching all the way to the end of the video there's lots more content coming click the subscribe button below make sure you come back for more because there's great content always coming up every day in this channel see you next time peace